cult of Hasanabi. <laughs> Fucking roll, dude. Destroyed. Anyway, um, okay, let's get to the motherfucking awards, okay? It's time, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to do Hasanabi Year in Review, okay? We are going to, I'm going to turn it on into a, uh, into a slideshow. Hasanabi 2022, A Year in Review, okay? Wait, there's sponsors? What the fuck? The shouts out to the moderation team and the community for making this. Okay. I got to pee before we get started on this. Okay. I'm going to go pee real quick and then we're going to get started finally. Okay. It's happening though. Hold on. It's time, ladies and gentlemen, for the Hasanabi 2022 Year in Review, the Community Awards. You all voted for it over the past month or so. And now, let's take a look at the fruits of your labor. Starting with the Golden Stunlock, sponsored by Fossabot. Didn't know we had sponsors. 2022 Year in Review categories are Community, best community meme, best don't tell Hassan Piker you're a blank meta. Best controversy, best community made song. Mod recap, best Twitch mod, best Hassan fit, best thirst trap. In gaming, we have best gaming arc, best gaming moment. In the stream, only, only two categories for fucking gaming. In the stream moments, best IRL stream, best IRL stream moment, best ad segue, cringiest stream moment, best stream guests, best stream of 2022. And on podcast, best fear and new permanent host, best fear and moment, and best leftovers moment. Now, the beautiful part about this is that I also don't know who won. I don't know any of these results. This is the first time I'm taking a look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get started. Disclaimer, the categories were submitted by Narrowed Down and voted on by the community. Total number of votes is 5,769. Why? Why only 5,769? Because you motherfuckers don't vote. Because leftists don't vote. You can't get leftists to vote for anything. No matter what fucking happens, leftists turn out. That's right. Let's continue. All right. Podcast, Fear Anna Leftovers. And the best new permanent host for... Fe Wait, where do I put myself? Like here? Is this better? I guess. Category four, best new and permanent host choices were... Austin, Ludwig, Will, and Cutie Cinderella. Hold on. Oh, 
for best beer and new permanent host choices. And the winner is Cutie Cinderella with 40.5% of the votes. Cutie Cinderella is the best, is the winner for beer and permanent and guest co-host. That's crazy. Okay, so here are the best fear and choices. Let's take a look. Number one, Fusli's bathing habits. I shower before the stream, but I couldn't. I didn't have time, so then I was like, "Frick!" You ever wash your shower cap? Or you just keep your hair. Oh no, I actually bathe every day. That's a cre the thing. Oh what? Oh wait, what? What? Uh, wait, what? Wesley, what? this is a. You just told us you shower every day. Then what? I'm talking wash my hair. <laughs> what are you? Hey, what is what, going on what, right now? What? So this wait, entire is time. All? I'm, <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You wait. wash your body every day. Yes. <laughs> wait. The internet has thought for years that you do not wash yourself, no. but once a week. No. And no, it's I all because you thought showering meant washing your hair? <laughs> yes! Next up is Ludwig is a jock. On the land. <laughs> Ludwig is like the first jock I've ever dated. <laughs> okay, stop! Stop! She said jock. This pissed off Ludwig so much that he literally called me fat and made fun of the Jets. Ludwig is a jock, dude. I mean, like, jock. What do you think? Like, Smash is an athletic competition? What the okay, fuck? Okay, okay. I'm saying, like, jock body type. Like, <laughs> Stop. Stop. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Wait, wait. Wait, what is your... Oh, my God. You're... You, you, what? No, Ludwig let's unpack this. Is. You think Ludwig is an athletic person? He, I think he's, he's got the like, archetype of a jock. Yeah. He could Until be a jock in a him, former life. Then he's life. a theater kid. No, he look he looks like with the shirt on. If he was wearing a varsity jacket, he looks like he could play the role of a jock in a in a in you know 1960s exactly. yes, yes, in a exactly. 1960s Disney flick when like yes. people weren't really working out. <laughs> Rude, nice number one. Body. He, <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> I'll tell him you said that. Yeah, no, and he's working on it too. He's been sending me updates. What? <laughs> okay, that was the second oh, clip. Ludwig is a jock. Ludwig cult. I think I want to start a cult. Wait, why did this happen? What is? What did I do? Oh, I fucking uh, I took it off full screen. Oops. Hold on. That's why I was like, what the fuck? Dude, I'm so stupid. I literally didn't even understand what was going on. Wait, why can't I uh, make it full screen again? What the fuck? So today yeah. I was. Hold on. What? How do I go back to slideshow? Okay. Oh, we're back. We're back. We're back. I did it. We're back. We're back. Yeah, number one U.S. streamer, by the way. Okay, Ludwig Cult. Is I think I want to start a cult. I think you should start a cult. And I'm hoping well, you guys can be my hype Boys, man. the plan is simple. <laughs> we're starting a cult. We're worshiping God today. Yeah. And he made a million dollars in the past, like, six months from Super Chats. That's oh, wow. wild, which is a, a crazy amount because it's USD. Well, I think. you got to get it all the way to God. So, you know. yeah, <laughs> he's really close right now. <laughs> like he's almost there. God Hell damn. evangelist, man. God damn. I That's what, feel the Holy Spirit. I bet. I bet he has no drama. If you're listening to this pod right now, what you need to do is you need to pick up your credit card. You need to die. One of the chats said, who's this Malfoy looking guy next to you? He seems to be in a few of the episodes. Uh, That's Ludwig. You mean the blonde guy, right? Yeah, the, his name is Ludwig. He's a content creator. Amen. Hallelujah. Because Woo. the fear and pod, we need a private Woo. jet. Because private we're jet. coming Woo. to your neck of the woods. Your neck we're of the coming woods. to you in Tulsa, Dude. Alabama. Woo. We're coming to you in Daytona, Florida. Daytona. And we're bringing the power of God. 
with us. <laughs> now I'm going to lay hands on this boy and I'm going to emancipate the demons. Are you ready, son? Yes. I'm going to lay hands uh, on you. Uh, uh, demons. Uh, uh, subscribe. How are you going to say this fucking, Please. this podcast is not a banger, bro? Wait. Once you go full screen, you can't get it I out. I think I want to start a cult. I think you should. It's weird. It, like, won't let you get out of full screen. And then it fucks up the slide. So, I'm just not going to do a full screen. I'm sorry. Do you guys like London? I used to live in London. Well, yeah. Yeah, we got proper kit here, bruv. It yeah. was a pang thing. <laughs> yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm gonna, so we were there during the heat, heat wave. Okay, okay. Yeah, there's like no AC. There's anymore. no AC. Yeah, so yeah, what are they? Air con. There's <laughs> no air con, bro. So it was, it was a little brutal, but also I did have one experience that I fucking love. All right, all right. I went to the Ritz. Oh, wow, you went to the Ritz. Bro, y'all picked two Connor Dog Virginia clips? What the fuck? There were no other... There were no other fucking uh, yeah, clips did, like, from any other course. podcast. Yeah. What the, the fuck? The best part was like the way that they spoke to us. So we ordered a beef Wellington, and okay. the beef Wellington was so good. We're like, get another one, and we we call our server over, and we're like, hey, yeah. uh, we'd love to place, an and he's like, sir, I am so sorry, I do not know if we have the resources to do this. Let me check with the chef. <laughs> and, it, <laughs> and, and we're like, we're like, oh my, couldn't clip the paid stuff. No, you could have clipped the paid stuff. I don't give a shit. Yeah, I'd like. We didn't know it was such a big ordeal, and he's like, Apologies, gentlemen. The chef simply cannot make another <laughs> Wellington. There is no way I, to add another Wellington. And we're like, No, it's it's fine. And he's like, he's like, I am so sorry. I will speak with the chef again. And he leaves, and he comes back. He's like, I have checked again. There is no way we can do the Wellington. He's and working like, for the tip, man. And we're, yeah, we're like, we're like, I got, it's, so, it's, 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 it's okay. You know, we just, we have enough food. Yeah. He just comes back. He's like, Ten minutes later, he comes back. He's like, Gentlemen. It just only goes to show that like uh, none of you motherfuckers watch Fear End, I think, or the so ones that got the, the clips that got clipped. <laughs> he's becoming he's more going, Japanese he's now. He's going to do yeah. one more Wellington. Oh my god! <laughs> Man, he's just like, shit. Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. He's he's like, like, no, no. They bring out the trumpet the, like. The, the, <laughs> <laughs> they say simply on her. <laughs> so we got that second Wellington. It felt perverse. Was it good? Like, this Wellington's not supposed to. Wait, wait, wait. Second Wellington, simply on her. I have a confession. Like I asked Marsh because nobody sent anything for it. Oh, really? Okay, well, regardless. All right, let's see. So these were the four choices. So today yeah. I was really trying. And for some reason. I think I was like, in one 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 The winner is. In one <laughs> Ludwig is a like jock. I've ever dated. <laughs> okay. I mean, of course, that makes sense. All right. Moving on to best leftovers moment. The choices are frozen pizza taste test. There you go. That's fair. Don't pretend like that's bad. It's an unorthodox pizza. It has the consistency of cardboard. That's what it's been sitting out. Pretend that it's fresh. Okay. It still has the consistency of card. I'm pretending it's fresh. Pretend harder. Okay, do you want me to be honest, or do you want me to just, like, say it's good? <laughs> no, be honest. Okay. Um, a lot of sure. garlic. Yeah, yeah. A lot of garlic. Mm -hmm. um, That's good, right? Indiscernible, uh, the weird green stuff, which I assume is spinach. Yes, that is spinach. I love mm, I love frozen spinach on, on uh, topped on globs of, like, weird white cheese things. I, I'm a fan of white. I mean, I. I what is it's the pizza? Look at I mean, your glasses, bro. I, I'll have a white pizza every bro. now and then, right? Like, I'm not. I'm not against it. I'm not completely against it, but I will admit. I'm okay. Ryan Kavanaugh. Does top, Ryan so. Kavanaugh look like Harvey Weinstein? Dot com? <laughs> what the fuck? You know that's my website, right? That's <laughs> 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 so stupid. <laughs> We made that website to help the public. <laughs> it's uh, now on the front page. <laughs> no, this is to help. Uh, this is to help people like you. Hassan. <laughs> this is a public service. Oh my God! This is this is good for Ryan because people, you know, who are people casual. People them, yeah. Yeah, and so like if you go down. The public is confused. Oh my God! Like, okay, look at this. dude, the, the slider. Oh no! Do you I'm see dead. the resemblance? Dude, the slider makes it so much worse. The slider straight up is like it's the same person but ginger. 
Exactly. That's what I'm saying. So it's important. Oh, probably find on the top. That was a that was another classic. Okay. Hassan eats bull dick. I mean that's, that's a fat. Ooh, that's a crazy wait a minute. one. Has some of the testicle juice on there also. You got wait the a one. minute. Yummy. Balls First of and testes. All, this is the tip of the penis. Is that the that's officially the, that's tip? the tip? Yeah, yeah the yellow yeah, part yeah. is the. Is that is that considered the the? It smells the pickles, filet so mignon. That's the tip. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah about to find out. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be able to have the whole thing. I Just like, crunch it's it. It's gummy. Like, it's, it's like not, gum. It's like gum. Yeah. Yeah. You can't you can't fucking. It's eat. primal gum. Chef, do you like this food on your on your free time when you're at home with your family? Do you eat this stuff? I love working with it because it's you know raw organs is something it's that. It's so I, sinewy. <laughs> Yeah, you don't have to swallow it. You can I can hear the crunch. Is this just Hassan? Best moment on H3? What are we watching? Uh, the I have two podcasts. One is called Fear and The other one's called Leftovers with H3H3 with Ethan. And uh, we just did the best Fear and moment. Now we're uh, looking at the best uh, Leftovers moment. The primal. You guys voted for this stuff. Well, let's see. I don't know. Hi, I'm Dick Chip. He's having a hard time. <laughs> Hassan is chewing. He's having a hard time with it. Yeah. Just he's, he's, oh, he's he's putting just down. down that dick, dude. Oh, yeah, yeah baby. Oh. 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 Yeah, we had some good moments with Liver King. Turns out he's a uh, fraud, I'm, though. I'm just getting rid of this. this one is uh, the C word tier list. The of the obvious ones, pink dick. I mean, pink dick. That one I think actually came from Bobby Lee. Pink dick. Pink yeah. dick. Yeah, he he, he calls uh, his producer George uh, pink dick all the time. That's this fun. is why depression. <laughs> uh, white people is gonna be F. I'm sorry, block Twitter. White people. White people. Yeah, that one is fucking annoying. I I, I don't like that one, and I don't like Y T. Like instead of saying Whitey, like black Twitter will write like Y and T mm. as a substitute for Whitey, and it's just like it just looks. It's lame. Like it's yeah, not, white people. It's just it milk. doesn't have like a oomph to it. You know what um, I mean? Yakubian. I'm sorry again. I like, love I love Yakubian. Fucking like deep anime lore. I don't know. That's like a fucking. Oh, dude! I'll show you some videos after this. <laughs> it is straight up. There is an anime. A Yakubian? Oh. Yeah. Uh, I'm I'm just getting rid of the of the obvious ones. Pink dick. I mean, pink dick. All right. And the winner of best leftover moment is the C word tier list with 34% of the votes. Burr, burr. Okay, moving on. Now we're getting into the category of gaming. Here are the best gaming moment choices. One, number one, Elden Ring Malding. Oh, no! Dude, what is happening? Fuck! That one was rough, I'll be honest with you. That, that was a tough one. Okay. The next one is Myth Motivation. As he coached me through Valorant. Valorante, Myth Coaching. It's pretty good. Don't leave anything up to chance. I will not. I believe in you, pal. We all believe in you. You're a winner, kiddo. Don't you ever forget. Yes, you are. You're a fucking winner. What are you going to do in that? I'm next a game? winner. I'm gonna do? win! You're gonna win! I'm gonna fucking win, dude! That was, uh, yeah, that was the, the myth moment. Um, Plant Dummy, we just watched. 
This is literally like a what? wait. Oh, Valorant Haven. Okay, he has one subscriber. Yo, plant dummy. Hey, plant. Did I win? I don't know, but I've gotten plant. a lot better at playing Valo. Plant. plant. Oh, I have it. Oh my God, I have it. I thought she had it. Uh, hold on. And then. Next one is the quarry. Another one that we watched already, but Hassan's soy boy scream is the title of this one. Uh, wonderful. Uh, great. Love that. Love. Love that. Hold on. Dude, pressing escape doesn't work. Can we please stop? Can we? Can you? Can you stop backseating my stream? I think our imagination. Ah! <laughs> Fuck you! Max. That's. Oh. Oh, never mind. This is a different one. No, 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 no. Oh, this is a compilation. Like that was the fucking that, that, was, just, that was stupid. Demonstrate what's scary. Pretty cool, huh? That was you know, I don't like that. I used to think that way I wasn't I wasn't scared of that. There's a squirrel. Who would be scared of that? Ah. That that's dumb, stupid. I wasn't even scared of it. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this shit. Not encampment, but like. <laughs> oh, ah, no, 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 no. <clears throat> that was. That this clip is only made worse by the fact that I literally have the lights on too. Like the lights are completely on, which makes it so much worse. Okay. I was demonstrating what would look like if I was scared. Yeah, it's fake I for content. It's totally that fake. That was to show you. What it looks like when someone is scared. Um, I love those because it's like, uh, people people will like whenever one of those makes it onto LSF, people will still be like, "Oh, dude, he's faking it. You guys are dumb." And I'm like, "Yeah, that guy's right." That's the one instance. That's the and then the last one is Turkish yelling, titled Turkish yelling. Um. That's the one instance where my haters, I'm like, I'm in agreement with them. You know what I mean? I'm like, yeah, my haters are correct. I, I, I am faking it for content. Totally. Yes. I don't play safe. Oh, I'm dead. Ah! Oh, I'm gonna How do you do it? No! Ah! 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 Oh, shit. Oh, he's on me. Ah! Dude, I yelled so much while playing back rooms that it gave me a headache. Like, unironically, I had a fucking headache. Ah! I'm fucking dying! I'm so fucked up! I'm dead! I'm dead! Ah! 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 The smile monster! And it, it's a tickle party! What? <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know. I don't even. I was just saying things at that point. You know what I mean? All right. I don't play safe. Ah, no! Wait, no! what the fuck? Why did they all start at the same time? Okay. Uh, and the. Hold on. We're gonna turn it on to the slideshow again. Oh, and the award for safe. best gaming moment goes to. I don't play safe. Turkish yelling! I really thought Corey would have won that one, but I guess this one won. With 29.9%. Best gaming arc choices are... Alien Isolation. Okay, hold on. Best gaming arc choices are... 
Alien Isolation, Elden Ring, Pokemon Arceus, Arceus, God of War Ragnarok, which I never finished, Mortuary Assistant, or Valorante Child Game, It Takes Two, which I never ended up finishing because of Carl, Stray, and Little Nightmares. And the winner is Elden Ring with 32%, which makes sense. I didn't realize. I thought they were going to show clips of it. Now we move on to Community. Pepela Community. Mod recap. By not your average African, we proud few who raise our swords in defense and peace stand vigilant. We proud few who, with moderation, serve the greater good. We the few, the proud, the mods. Wait, what the fuck is this? Is it Link? 2022 mod recap by not your average African. What the fuck? Wait, what? What? 27,000 bands? 29 thousand timeouts god damn what the fuck dude y'all are menaces in this fucking community 29,179 timeouts top number five snipers lake mcgroove with 22,000 824 actions. Holy shit. Betelgeuse, 8,494 actions. Nice bathroom with 8,077 actions. Young Peasy with 6,142 actions. Fizz with 5,829 actions. And not your average African at top six because he had to include himself with 3,253 actions. Lake I Never Ban Anyone McGroove with an insane performance. What the fuck? Moving on to unban requests. 5,000 unban requests, give or take. And can you guess what the top reason is? Begging? Oh. Top reasons from 600 on ban requests. Number one, transphobia. Number two, drama bait and brigades, including LSF's Clippers, Stream Hoppers, and Dick Riders. Number three, insults. Comments including physical appearance and insults towards guests. Number four, Chud takes. Number five includes police brutality defenders, anti-immigrants, and COVID denial. Number six, Ukraine. Number seven. Wait, what? Oh, this got fucked up. You, you, you fucked it. You, nice formatting, dude. Okay. Number four is Chud Takes, which includes police brutality defenders, anti-immigrants, and COVID denial. Number, number five, Ukraine, which includes bad faith interpretations, brigades, spam about pre-invasion take. Wait, what? Oh, yeah. Number six, toxicity and spam includes news-only frogs, chat spammers, and toxic gaming viewers. Number... Seven, racism. Number nine, or number eight, misogyny, including incels and Tate meat riders. Number 10, or number nine, Islamophobia, includes Zionist takes. Number 11, woke scolds. I'm more leftist than you, bat chest, includes fem cells. Number 12, which is lower on the list than I expected. Unprompted sexual comments, including coomers that went too far. Number 13, anti-Semitism. Includes Kanye Dick writers and random Nazis. Number 14, sexual assault and rape apologia. 
Number 15, homophobia. Number 16, Russia. Includes pro-war Russia simps. Number 17, ableism slash fat phobia. Number 18, mistakes. Including tactical misfires and ambiguous sarcastic messages. Number 19, self-promo. And number 20, pedophilia. Including lolly fans. Shouts out the nice bathroom for the animations. Okay, thanks. Bye. That includes our, that concludes our mod recap in our year 2022 year in review. All right, let's move on. And after that, it's time for best Twitch mod choices. Let's see how the community, let's see what the community decided on who the best Twitch mod was. <laughs> Someone said, Fist said Aiden did nothing. <laughs> Listen, he, he set up Fossabot. That's enough. Yeah, well, I wonder where is where is Frogan? Well, Frogan Frogan made the stuff. Made the list. The bot that did 3.2 million timeouts in the last 6 weeks across Twitch, leave me alone. Yeah, if you guys the the funniest thing is like a lot of people don't realize but like, you know who the real you know who the real 1984 guy is? It's this fucking guy. Okay? It's his fucking bot, dude. He's literally Mr. George Orwin, 1987, Animal Factory, Animal Farm, Animal Crossing, dude. <laughs> the, the fucking man that created, the man that created the weapon that chatters fear the most. All right, let's take a look. And the winner is Nice Bathroom with 27%. Are you... Really? It, what's up you guys are you guys are picking favorites because uh, wh wh what's the deal here you're, you're picking favorites because he doesn't fucking ban that much is that what it is he does pick he does ban a lot you gotta click this link now Moonlight, spotlight. I don't even really want a spotlight, uh, but they really put me in the limelight. Uh, now I don't want to want a spotlight, uh, and I got that uh, new pipe. Uh, what I want to do with this new pipe? Uh, got a desert eagle and it's Fortnite. Uh, uh, play it like it's Fortnite. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, in the moonlight, in the spotlight. Uh, I don't really, really want the limelight. Niggas put me in the motherfucking limelight. Niggas put me in the motherfucking limelight. You can move me under motherfucking limelight. Cause I really, really, really want to blow pipes. Like, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. Lil' Perry really go, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. Lil' Perry really go, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, uh. Okay, that's enough. I'm sorry. That's all I will. That, uh. No, no. That's, that's. I hate that so much. It just lives in my mind forever. I hate that. All right. Nice bathroom on that one. Mod of the year as recognized by the mod team was Lake McGroove, which is not very surprising. Uh, recount after that video. I mean, yeah, <laughs> I was robbed. Yeah. Lake McGroove is the sniper of the year. All right. Now it's time for best community meme, Pepela. Choices are, don't tell Hassan Piker you're blank. Running rampant all around motherfucking Twitter. Shouts out the Prezzo for that. Now everybody, anytime, now people think I do hate crimes for fun. Literally, just everyone on the internet just says that. I do hate crimes for fun. It's funny though. I, I don't mind it. Selfish Top Austin Show. Nipple pictures. 
Blammo! Add segues. Hank Pecker's return. Shit Camp Drag. The Bella Porch music video, which I did not actually get featured in, even though it was a bit of a meme in and of itself. And, last but not least, the queen. The queen dying. And ladies and gentlemen, best community meme winner is... Don't tell Hassan Piker you're blank. With 23.9% of the vote. Of course this won. Y'all fucking suck. I swear to God. What the fuck? <laughs> it makes sense. All right, moving on. Next up is... Don't best, don't tell Hassan Piker your blank meta choices. The choices were don't tell Hassan Piker you're gay. Don't tell Hassan Piker you're trans. This one had like a bunch of them, by the way. There was like an entire week of like every fucking e girl who wanted to flex. Uh, uh, photos of themselves who wanted to get fucking viral, okay? Posting. Don't tell us on Piker you're trans memes. Morgan with don't tell us on Piker you're Muslim. And the last one is don't tell us on Piker you're a weeb, but I don't even know what that did that even happen? I don't even know what the last one is. And the winner is... Don't tell Hassan Piker you're gay by Prezzo. Congratulations, Prezzo. If I catch you in the streets, I will whoop your ass. That is your award. I can't believe the top of the hour ad break didn't win that one because it is the top of the fucking hour. And it's time for another three minute ad break. Ladies and gentlemen, at the top of the hour, there's a three minute ad break. And if you no longer want to see those ads, all you need to do is subscribe. If you want an uninterrupted broadcast experience, if you want to make sure you catch up on all the award winners. Don't tell us on Piker there's an ad at the top of the hour because it's coming. Now, if you no longer want to see those ads, all you need to do is subscribe for $5 or for free with a Switch Prime. By connecting your Amazon Prime account to your Twitch account, you will get one free Prime subscription a month. Use it on your favorite broadcaster. Hopefully it's me, your favorite homophobe, your favorite LGBTQ foe. You can also... This is the last of the year. The last top of the hour of the year for the East Coast. It's coming up in an hour. 5B Obi, thank you for the 20 gifted subs. And Garrick Grosso, thank you for the five gifted subs. For some of you, it's the first ad break of the year. Ewig with the five gifted subs. Here's the three minute ad break now. Rendoa, thank you for the 10 gifted subs. Moving on to our next best controversy choices. Number one, we have Hassan Piker's Porsche. Number two, we have Russia plus Ukraine. On number three, we have Austin Ox's very own crafted, well, two of these are Austin Ox, the Gucci shirt. Number four, we have Andrew Tate, top G, top groomer, top sex trafficker. And at number five, we have the Gamba debate. And the winner for best controversy choices is Andrew Tate with 35.2%. Wow. Top G. What a guy. I'm surprised that that one won. Holy shit. Yeah, recency bias, I think. Uh, probably. My man won this even from in jail, dude. He's in Romanian prison. He needs all the W's he needs. He can get right now. Hassan's 350Z. 
Thank you for the 10 gifted subs. Valor Key. Thank you for the 5 gifted subs. Rendoa, thank you for the 10 gifted subs. And Sleep is Awesome. Thank you for the 5 gifted subs. Okay. Moving on to our next. Category. Best Community Made Song Choices. Number one is. Esperando a Hassan, Waiting for Hassan, the Mexican Corrido version. Road to Blamo song featuring Hasanabi. Hashtag Hasanabi is streaming the punk rock cover. Hassan's Porsche, Ari at Home. And last but not least, Hassan is streaming cover by Phaseria. The award for best community made song choices goes to Esperando a Hassan, waiting for Hassan, the Mexican corrido version. You become more Mexican. I used to be Italian and now I'm Mexican. This is true. That's right. Shouts out to Borlo and Seba Dentis for Esperando a Hassan. That was a ten ten grito, by the way. Not a big fucking deal. Cuando entro yo pregunto ¿Dónde está el hombre turco? Y me pongo a llorar Y de repente Mis pantallas se refrescan La canción está sonando Vamos ya a comenzar Cuando al fin dicen En Los Angeles, California. Es un día bien hermoso. Grito and I never Gracias give sub again. Don't do it again. Are you crazy? Como siempre. That was a fucking fire, Grito. You are just a jealous hater, bro. Don't be don't be jealous. Don't worry. Turks are Flexicans and Flexicans are Turks. Moving on to the best Hassan fit choices. All right, this is this is going to be one that hurts my soul, okay? Option number one is at the Streamies, the Gucci Harry Styles collaboration, which drew ire and controversy. Well, technically, they all did. Option number two is when I got COVID and decided to put an insane ensemble together, which I admit doesn't work that well. Number three was I am not a weeb, by the way. The MXDVS fit only improved by... The classic staple Hasanabi Doc Martin platforms and the Akatsuki Hypeland collaboration from the Naruto collection, which was sent to me by, which was sent to me on my P.O. box. Option number four was Coachella Day 2. This one I like to call the Guy Fieri is alive and well. With an incredible Zoomer ass Y2K tribal tattoo fit up top. And party in the bottom. Option number five was the streamer awards fit that I wore, which is also uh, the most Mexican I've ever been in my entire life. This is the quinceanera fit with the leopard tux top, the bolo tie, and the Texas cowboy pattern shirt. And option number six is, of course, the dripper drown stream. I forget the brand, but it's a it's a cool brand. The winner for best Hassan fit is this one, the Streamer Awards. The the Quinceanera. 35.1% chose this one. Okay, I, I dig it. I think it's fire. Alright. Now let's get to the good shit. Best thirst trap choices, ladies and gentlemen. Option one, 
TwitchCon EU Amsterdam hotel room. I'm feeling kind of slutty with it. Option number two is Himbo Fitness launch. Option number three is TikTok watermelon sugar. And option number four is overall nipple slip. A lot of these are our top contenders. I assume option number three is the one that won, though. That's the one that got the most play, but it's not up to me. It's up to you. The best thirst trap choices winner. The best thirst trap award goes to the TikTok right, folks, so watermelon. I made a promise originally that I was going to crush a watermelon with my thighs literally the least surprising one i knew that it was going to be this one because uh, you know you guys went fucking feral already at 115 in the first day it's still going on on my stream by the way so promises made promises kept promises made promises ethical kept. thirst trapping with a side of right, so fundraising it. for abortion charities okay. The funniest thing is this TikTok Ooh. in and of itself didn't go that viral, but like the response to it was lie, more I viral. I thought that, uh, you know, this would be more explosive of a break. I think I'm going to give it more of a crush in a second just to really get the juices out. Okay. We're going to give it a second try. I'm going to keep crushing it further. My brother recorded this. See you can see him in the background right down. here sitting on top of a chair. Ugh. Okay, that was a little bit better. Oh god, it's so nasty. Ah, ah. Freshly crushed watermelon. Directly from my thighs. I'm gonna I'm gonna sell these. To raise more funds for abortion. I'm continuing to fundraise today, by the way. That's right. Okay, congratulations to all of you for experiencing those thirst traps. All right, up next is the best sub community choices. Now, this one is probably should not have even been done if we're being real, because apparently some of you dumb motherfuckers fought one another. Uh, I don't want to know about it. I don't want to hear about it. OK, it is literally the dumbest thing to fucking argue over. We have Hostwit, Discord. And offliners. No, like literally, I, I apparently you guys are like fighting amongst yourselves or something. It's, it's, it's so stupid. Okay, I hate that more than anything else. I promise you. All right, best sub sub community choices or uh, best sub community winner is everybody. Who do I ban? I don't even know who to fucking ban for this! Why are you like this? What am I? Who do I ban? Do I ban everyone? And that's it. Oh, hostile stream. Okay. Is that is that the end of it? Oh, no. Never mind. We're moving on to... Best IRL stream. Choices are TwitchCon EU, Flight Simulator with Austin, Anime Convention with Ludwig, Carl, Foolish, and Tina, Shopping with Will Neff and Carl Jacobs, TwitchCon San Diego, Forging Swords with Valkyrie, Shopping with XQC, I Did a Thing, and Boy Boy, New York City IRL with Blau, Valkyrie, Saikuno, Foosley, and Tina. Now, there's a lot of IRL choices, and honestly, it's hard to pick uh, one of them. I know. This was probably one of the harder ones to choose from because they're all fucking goaded. Let's be real. The boy, P 
puts out incredible content, okay? You know it. I know it. We all know it, okay? I'm out here busting ass for you. Let's see which one won the best IRL stream. Flight Simulator with Austin. At 46.5%, the Flight Sim with Austin won the number one. <laughs> and that's, a, that's not real. That photo is not real. Stop for legal purposes. That photo is not real. All right. Now we move on to the best IRL stream moment choices. Option one. Do you know who I am? Let's wrap, the, let's wrap up the, the IRL stream that I did with this last video. I'm going to give you guys a trigger warning real quick because this was incredibly, incredibly awkward. So this, uh, this, little, l this little hunk over here, he just fucking rolls up to me, okay? He says, hey, are, are you guys vloggers? vloggers? Uh, political commentators. No. Um, uh, polit and Blau's like, no, nah, we're political commentators. Political commentators? He thinks we're cool. fucking with cool. him. Have a good one. What are you guys doing? Buddha. Twitch.tv Twitch slash, slash Buddha. Um, I have none. Like 500,000. He was starting to get on my fucking nerves. Like, how many followers? How many followers? I'm like, what is this guy trying to fucking do over here? Like, what, what are you doing? Like, the vibes were so fucked. That's not how you hang out with normal people. That's just not how you do, okay? Am I crazy? Like, I just, I felt like this is not how you are supposed to be as a person. Like, this is not how you person, okay? It's just very weird. It's a very weird thing to do. And I feel like it's just, you know, homie is a TikToker. So he just, like, doesn't understand how to do, like, normal interactions with, like, normal humans. Even though what we're doing right now is, like, abnormal, right? Like, I have a fucking camera and a fat backpack on, so I'm, and I'm broadcasting like 30,000 people, and he's the weird one. How did you do that? Low elo social skills? Yeah, straight up. Man try to G-check you, but with clout? Yeah. He's like, oh, how many followers? How many followers? I'm like, bro, stop. Twitch side. Okay, that's enough. That, 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 we all remember the clip, okay? I don't want to, I don't want to go through it again. Option number two is... Oh. Zoyle launches Maya into the fucking stratosphere. Subsequently killing Maya Higa. Option number three is... I wonder what this does. A son! Bank oh, angle. Bank 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 like, if you get hit by Speedy's gun, it will hurt. So I feel saying. like more than what? it would get. Chat saying, yeah. Why, why specifically no. his gun? Is his gun like modified or something? No, well, he, ha he brought his own gun. Like, he has his special gun. Can I use your gun? Maybe you guys should, maybe you should all be against Speedy. Why do you want? Chad, you're baiting? Speedy would survive. It's gonna fit now. Tell us all oh, the queen is glasses. dead. Hassan, uh, can we get a report? No, it's just medical. Uh, I mean, the fit. latest is... The you latest is still right. just breaking from Buckingham Palace. Okay. What's happening to my queen? She's under medical supervision. She's going to die, as you no, know. No, she's, she's going to be fine. <laughs> no, she's definitely going to die, but... Oh, my God! She did die! No, she didn't! The royal family's official Twitter account said the queen died peacefully at Balmoral this afternoon. The king and queen concert will remain at Balmoral this evening and will return to London tomorrow. Woo! Let's go! Get queen! <laughs> what the 
Smoking on the queen pack. Here, have some. Have some. Have some. Have some. Have some of the queen pack. He's having some. Yeah. Listen, why is the why is, why is the queen's death ceremonious? I mean, she sucks. She's awful. The, 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 they're monarchs. It's just like automatically bad. Got it. Like you what don't even have to think like you know you have to justify like oh bankers are kind of evil or like CEOs are kind of bad. Like you don't even have to justify. It. It's just they're literally kings and queens. They're oh. awful. Slavery, oh. colonialism, oh. and and the bounties of such uh, awful endeavors. Hey, you queen. Can I try and shoot one of these balloons from there? <laughs> she seemed nice. Alrighty. Shut up. We need to hold on tight until we're done with paintball so Rasan can stream it. Are you really that desperate to go stream the Queen's death right now? <laughs> yes. Are you kidding me? Okay. She's a semblance of the... F she's literally a relic of the monarchy. It's like the... It is extremely my shit to dance on her grave unceremoniously. Um. <laughs> Option number five is uh, Anime Expo oh. Awkwardness. Oh. Holy Holy Lord. Lord. Which you saw already. No, no, absolutely not. Oh, I'm sorry. That's okay. My boyfriend asked me to kiss you. It's still, yeah, the answer is still Can no. I'm sorry. Kiss you? What? Can my boyfriend kiss you? No kisses from anybody. Oh my god. Okay, we got him. All right, dude. We, we, what we got about for, for daddy? You want to kiss? Here you go. Oh! Oh! Sorry. Pride month is sorry, over. Cheated. Pack it up. And option number six, click last one. College girl next door, Hannah. Come on out, Hannah. Hasanabi turns into a woman. That was fucked up. I got robbed. Like, straight up. I got fucking robbed, dude. I got fucking robbed, dude. Okay? I, I just... I'll never forgive and I'll never forget. Do you understand me? I'll never forgive and I'll never forget. Anyway, here. Let's let's wrap... Okay, wait. Hold on. Oh, shit. Slideshow is going to be awkward. Hold on. Anyway, here. Let's, let's wrap the... Let's wrap up the... the and the winner of the best IRL stream moment is Austin Plane Crash. Hassan! Oh! Jesus Christ! Oh! Oh! There you go. Moving on to, oh shit, this is my favorite one. This is where I get a little hype here. You don't have the figure for that dress? How dare you? I got titties for days, bitch. How dare you? Jealousy's a disease, love. Get better soon, okay? All right, best ad segue choices are... Awesome raids on Molten Core, and he'd be able to take down Ragnaros. After the initial collapse, we're going to be coordinating these people I know, many, many, many of them. If you too would like to coordinate with people, many, many, many of them online, you might want the help of a VPN. And that Give VPN me. packaging oh during God, Christmas so time would like it's particularly useful and so cringe when YouTubers put fucking ads in their videos. Who the fuck does that, dude? Lame. Yeah, Disgusting. It's so lame. So called leftists Especially as well. Scams, like yeah. Titles. Unlike Twitch hey, streamers who serve you three minutes of ads at the top of the fucking hour. You know what I'm saying? And <laughs> oh! you can ads by subscribing for five dollars or for free with a Twitch Prime, or by getting gifted a sub. Here's the three minute ad break now. Ooh. We don't give our our fans any way to avoid the ads. 
They, they have well, you could just skip it. Just <laughs> oh, yeah, true. Everyone yeah, skips, which I skip. Yeah. Yeah. That was a fire one, if I do say so awesome. myself. God damn. Awesome raids on Molten Core. Insane. Number two oh, is... Canes, 11 bucks there. Yogurt Land. Yogurt Land, man. See, it's like... got an oil change, in and out Starbucks again. I See, okay, that person is not a millionaire. That's a barista, and it's like perfectly normal. His consumption is insanely normal. What the fuck? Like, it's gonna show five dollars for a Hasanabi subscription to avoid the top of the hour ad break. That's perfectly normal. You know what I mean? Or maybe it'll show that he got a free one uh, in the form of a Twitch Prime by connecting his Amazon Prime account to his Twitch account. Or maybe it's gonna show that he got lucky and got gifted a sub. I'm so proud. Perfectly I'm so proud of myself. The top of the hour ad break. That's right now, baby. Whoo! Sheesh! Fucking got him, dude. Hey, here's the woman ad break now. <laughs> oh, your pride will take you down. No, it won't. Okay, hold on. Mental health. Uh, this is option number three. Is, is inherently supposed to be anti-capitalist. Okay, like treatment in general is like that, and especially mental health, uh, uh, healthcare. So, any kind of solution you offer is going to be very costly, and it's it's not going to be productive overall. It's not super profitable. It's not going to be productive. That's why you see the profitable measures that people take, like Better Health, uh, be uh, disastrous. Okay. So what do we do? We just fucking avoid it. Just like you can avoid the top of the hour ad break by subscribing for five dollars or for free with a Twitch <sighs> Prime. Oh my god. That one. That's a nasty one because it, it just. That, that, <laughs> that was nasty with it. Roasted. I, I honestly think he might be too stupid to recognize he's a Nazi. Like, Nick Fuentes, I think, is at least, like, smart enough to hide his, like, legitimate perspective, but, like, gets really horny and openly fucking says his desires. And it's very easy to catch him doing that. But, um... But, like, I think he's just really dumb. Like, I think Baked Likes is just fucking stupid, dude. Like, doesn't realize that the top of the hour is here and that there's a 60-second ad break coming. You know what I mean? <laughs> doesn't realize that, like, if he no longer wants to see those ads, all he needs to do is subscribe, which he could do for $5 or for free. <laughs> I love the drive-by ones. God, I love the ad break segues, dude. Holy shit. It, it, that one... That was just a drive-by one where it's like, yeah, just he's so stupid. <laughs> oh, you know that was good. Shut the fuck up. That he could just also get gifted a sub. That was a solid 9 out of 10, maybe 10, 10. I snuck that in so well. No inflection change whatsoever. Yeah, that true. Okay, so the winner of best ad segue choices is treatment. This one is, is inherently supposed to be anti-capitalist. Okay, like treatment in general is like that, and especially mental health. Uh, the John Oliver one. That's crazy. Mental health. Uh, that's crazy. The John Oliver one. One. I think the Baked Alaska one was better. All right, moving on to cringiest stream moment choices. The John Oliver one is evil, dude. Cringiest stream moment choices. Option one. That's it. He DM me. Mitch Jones. And then the rest of it is just like him. Let me see if there's any, like, you know, private information. No, look. He said I was clout chasing him, dude. What the fuck? How was I clout chasing him?
Dude, why do people say stuff like this all the fucking time, dude? God damn, that was fucking brutal, dude. Holy shit. Option number two is... I got Starbucks. I got star. I don't even like coffee, but I guess I'll try it. Yeah. Delicious. Now let's see what goodies await me in here. Ooh, a cake globe. Wait, cake pop. It appears to be a perfect sphere. Nice. It kind of looks like a turd. First bite incoming. Delicious. Yep, this is Nums. Activate Happy Dance. <laughs> Mods, new cost cord. It's over. Shut it down. We're shutting down the Discord. It's over. It's done. Um, this is the worst. This is the worst moment of my life. This is the worst. I will literally. Sinirli bozarak gülmeye çalışıyorlar. Abi başka açıklaması olamaz. Yok abi bilmiyorlar. Gülmeyi bilmiyorlar abi. Hayatında gülmemiş mi amına kuluklarım? I got so mad. I went Turkish, dude. Option number two was. We already saw it. It's the anime clip, uh, the anime kissy clip, which you know we don't we don't need to see again. I'm sorry. <clears throat> the will you kiss me? And then option number four is this one, which is not even awkward or cringe. Honestly, it's just good acting. So that's weird that you guys would post this on here. Yeah, this is just great acting. Uh, duh. Show the whole thing? No, it's just this. Viaz, thank you for the 14 gifted subs. Yeah, I'm so dead. Look, it literally feels like I'm actually dead. You guys probably got scared. That I was dead. That's why you were like cringing. You were cringing at your own situation because you were like worried that I was dead. You know what I mean? Okay. Fun. Oh, Jesus. We got to go through this. The cringiest stream moment winner is this one. I don't even like coffee, but I guess I'll try it. Delicious. Now let's see what goodies await me in here. This is literally my 9-11, okay? It's so fucked up. All right, let's move on to greener pastures. Best stream guest choices are... Austin Show. Even though he's gay. Felix Biederman of Chapo Trap House. Cutie Cinderella of former podcast... Whine about it. And now, potential new guest host slash co-host of Fear and Stavros Helkius. And last but not least, I did a thing and boy boy, also known as the Aussies. And the winner of best stream guest choices is Stavros Helkius. God damn. A big boy. A win for the big boys, like myself, which I am a big boy. Besh, now we're moving on to the best stream of 2022 choices. Number one is Spill Your Guts or Fill Your Guts with Cutie Cinderella Maya and Stavros Halkius. Number two is R slash place. Number three is Andrew Tate debate. And number four is Grimes on the broadcast. And the winner of best stream of 2022 is... Spill your guts or fill your guts with 36.9% of the votes. Makes sense. This was pretty fire. And last but not least, the best streamer of 2022 choices is Hassan Hasanabi Piker. Aww. 
Aww. Thanks, guys. And the best community of 2022 choices. What? Hey, yo. You ain't fuck me, you fuck the old body. You ain't fuck Nikki, you fuck Nicole body. Ain't no miles when this here nobody. Go up with the heads, these bitches is nobody. Mm. I, I mean, a nobody. Now I need some new fit. No little I spoke way I'm too soon, soon, okay? I, I spoke too soon. Now I need some new I was literally about to say the best best community award goes to you guys, my chat. And it turns out I was wrong, okay? Turns out. But shots don't duck unless the shoes Cookie can't make me the dope. Cookie can't come with the throat. Puff, puff, pass. No, you do not want the smoke. Big, big bitches be sleeping on me, but be claiming they won't. Fuck up a check on my body. Then let them look on my body. I'll deny God damn it, dude. Okay, I can't. This is copyright free. We can't be listening to this. I was so wrong. All right. See you next year. Thank you for participating. That was awesome. That was wonderful. We had some highs and we had some lows, but ultimately we have each other. Maybe you can win best streamer next year. Keep your head up. Hopefully. I can't even fucking, I can't even win my own goddamn uh, community awards, bro. What can I win? I've been, I'll just hold that L, you know what I mean? Alongside all the L's that I'm holding. 